The Glendale River Hill School Board refuses to take a student kicked out of a neighboring district. Our Ben Jordan was there for tonight's decision. The school board unanimously voted to deny that student's enrollment. And while there was no public comment at tonight's meeting, some parents tell me they're relieved by the decision and that the school superintendent owned his mistake. Yeah. In front of dozens Yay. of parents. Yay. Yay. With that, five yays. The Glendale River Hill School Board voted not to allow a student with a troubled past to enroll in their district. That student was expelled from Fox Point Bayside for allegedly making violent threats. I'd like to apologize to some community members and to the board. Last week, Glendale River Hill Superintendent Larry Smalley admitted he broke district policy by letting that student attend classes without board approval. I'm the one who put us in this situation. Glen Hills Middle School parents tell me the student was only in class for three days days last week before the district removed him. Um, I've urged the board to do what is compassionate, not necessarily what is legally correct. School board members shared frustrations about Smalley breaking district policy. Because of confidentiality laws, they made no mention of why they denied the students enrollment. I'm not surprised. I'm pleased with the outcome. Gina Mascani says she and several other parents were very concerned about student safety before tonight's decision. Some even kept their kids home from school. I think it brings up many concerns. Um, it goes beyond this issue at hand, but what could potentially happen if something were to occur with the student or others in breaking policy? Muscani hopes the student is able to receive an education elsewhere and that the district learns from this process. Both the school board director and superintendent Smalley declined my interview request. The school board made no mention as to whether Smalley will be reprimanded for breaking district policy. Reporting in Glendale, Ben Jordan, today's TMJ4.